Hey everyone, this is Fabio from Inno Games, and I'm here speaking for The Blitz, being at E3 and representing uh, some of our games. So, uh, the first title I would like to introduce to you is uh, Forge of Empires, which you might have seen in uh, lots of TV ads that are running throughout the US at the moment. And um, so, let me, let me tell you a little bit about like, what's, what's very special about uh, Forge of Empires. So Forge of Empires uh, originally started out as a browser strategy game three years ago, but by now we've moved out to lots of different platforms, including uh, iOS and Android, and you can play Forge of Empires as a cross-platform game throughout all of those um, platforms, and just uh, keep your account, uh, keep your login data, and just continue playing without losing anything. With Forge of Empires, it mostly goes about um, building up your city strategically. So you start as a small Stone Age village and then move on through all of uh, humanity's ages until to the uh, very near future. And uh, so you also have uh, a strategic part where you um, fight against other players. Um, you build up your city, you visit other players' cities, you get together in guilds and uh, trade with uh, people. So there's lots and lots and lots of stuff to do. Uh, we actually have uh, more than two years of content in the game, so you should uh, check it out right now. Um, play it on your iPad, download it on your uh, Android smartphone, or just go to the browser and type uh, fortunevampires.com. Go check it out. So the second game I wanted to introduce to you was just recently uh, released uh, throughout the US and the rest of the world, and it's called Elvenar. And uh, so you see the Elvenar lady here standing behind me. Um, so you can imagine it's a fantasy game. It's a fantasy city builder where at the beginning you have to decide whether or not you want to play with elves. And then your city is like very pretty, very organic. There's lots of trees and fantasy creatures in it. Or you go with the humans. And uh, the humans have more like uh, a complicated relationship with nature, as you might know. So they're just taking all of the resources and building very advanced cities made out of mostly metal and stone uh, and lots of steam-powered things. Um, so uh, you have to decide at the beginning what, what kind of is like your play style and then go from there and build up like the most beautiful, the most lush or the most, most advanced um, fantasy city that you can imagine.